Hi, I'm Drushnik, and welcome back to another episode of Arumian Hierarchy in Stellaris Distant Stars, where we have room for 43 more, um, I guess, fleet points. I don't know how many ships that is. It's probably not a whole lot. I would like to um, build a new fleet, but I don't think I can. Um, the ISS in Magra has discovered traces of a new strategic resource dubbed Grayscales. Okay, so they're over there. That's what they're doing. Now, in the meantime, we do have enough to upgrade the Science Nexus. See? Ooh, look. Just because, um, or exactly because I asked you guys to remind me, remind, I want to say remember, and then things went wrong, uh, to remind me about the Science Nexus, that's why it is working. That's why I'm remembering, because I asked you to help me. It's just weird how brains work, but they do work like that. Um, okay, let's see. So we have... Anomaly found. Yeah, let's leave the anomalies be for now, though, because I want you to survey as soon as possible so that we can lock those systems down. Um, now let's see. Hey, Trappist, you're not fully upgraded. Come on, man. I need more, uh, I need better naval cap. Because look at this. Can't increase um, cap over there. Ooh, but hang on. Ooh, we have a lot of potential. Naval cap razors. Yes, I want another fleet. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, that is very exciting. Um, let's see. Wait, let's pause the game though. I want to. If. I still haven't decided whether to attack the Ilkahans or not. I do think that is the easier option. They just... <laughs> Only a fool would go up against the Rumian hierarchy, armed as you are with a colossus. We are glad to count your empire among our friends. <laughs> that would be like the worst betrayal ever. It would just be so much fun, though. I mean, if you don't want to be friends with us, really friends, hmm, or go for the Spirans. You must be so weak right now. Pathetic. It'll just be, hopefully, easy. Yeah, it'll be easy. I hope. Okay. Um. Let's see. You are following the Sharp Toothers. You are following nobody. Let's have you merge. Let's do that. Um, you will be following... Is this the Claude Armada? No. Who's the Claude Armada? You. You'll be following... No, you guys. We'll be following the Claude Armada. You're the Tail Swisher, so you will be following the Tail Swishers. But I guess we can't get a leader for you, eh? Hmm. That's upsetting. I want more leaders. Oh well. Um. Let's see. Claude Armada will go here. Anomaly found. Leave B for now, man. I'm serious. I'm, I'm doing things. Uh, Tail Swishers. Well, I guess we can just go through this territory, and that will be the fastest way to get to the Spiron, so all of you should go there. Um, and then we'll just take this really quickly and move on to that side. Now, we could take our Colossal Kitten as well. It's just so slow. System survey complete. Mm, you can follow the Armada. System survey. Okay, we complete. have another strategic resource. Great dust. Wait, system survey complete. Did I hear that correctly? Yes, I did. Oh, gotta be fast. Wait, 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 wait. No, not you, not you, but you. Build. Okay, the Hasukar have already arrived here. Um, and then you're gonna go here. And while you survey that, and you survey that. Let's see. You're the only one Scientific without orders. Scientific breakthrough achieved. Oh yeah, you can't go there yet. 
Ooh, our naval cap. Yes! Okay, we can build another fleet. Empire leader cap, yay! Come on, hurry, so I can send that science ship out there. Um, and then go focus on a war. Okay. So we are building this starbase, and it's almost done. And I'm gonna upgrade it straight away. Just that I don't forget. Construction complete. Very good. Upgrade. Now I guess you can. Yeah, you can. You can build the mining stations. That's okay. Uh, are you already building a starbase? Yes, you are. After you're done surveying that, I want you to go survey that. Okay. Okay. Um, should we quickly? Yeah, let's quickly just make another fleet. Create two. We'll assign you the home base of... Uh, hmm. Should we have one here somewhere? There, there are gates here. Elegon, for example. That's where we have a gate. Let's do Elegon. Where are you? Oh, there is no, uh, shipyard there? Hmm. Well, that ruins things. Oh, yeah, here. Elegon. There we go. Okay. So you will have, uh, oh, you can't have another Titan, unfortunately. So let's do cruisers, destroyers, corvettes. Let's, uh, get eight battleships. Sixteen cruisers. Twenty destroyers to start with. Thirty corvettes. Thirty-one. Thirty-two. Yay! Okay. The problem is, maybe I should have done it more slowly because if I press reinforce now, well, I don't have a lot of minerals, so I'll be okay. There we go. Because I have a beautiful, beautiful name. Scientific breakthrough achieved. For this fleet, and I want to use it. Kinetic artillery, very good. Let's get the devastator construction upgraded. complete. Okay, we have this. Okay. So, uh, Spirens, would you uh, be my vassal? Hmm? <laughs> Da, 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 da. No? Really? We would smother our cubs, irradiate our worlds, and each Rumian would cut their open before serving you. Okay, well, let's do that then. To war! To war! Ooh, uh, total war. Let's not. Let's just vassalize them. Um. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Declare. At last! To war! Exactly. All of you guys. Go. Go, 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 go. Who's this? Prosnikans are <laughs> late claim Beginning on our system. Beginning attack on enemy station. Really? Really, guys? We are integrating you. Like, seriously. How much longer? 186 months. Okay, let's see. Um, this fleet is just gonna go like that, and that. Oh, you can't. Okay. Okay, I guess. Hmm. We have two more fleets. Tail Swishers just go right away, and the Claud Armada is also just gonna go over there straight away. Okay, so while we do that, let's, let's see, when you're done surveying roll, you're gonna survey that system over there. You're still doing that. We have this under our control. We are upgrading the start port, very good. Oh, this is gonna be some multitasking. Construction uh, complete. 101. Strategic resource, great actuators, very good. We'll see what all of these things do in a bit. Okay, so we have that starbase as well. 
Um, so now, how about sending the Clod Armada? Oh. Ugh. Oh, look at that. The Tzikian Watchers. Wait, what? Am I in your territory? Don't tell me I am in your territory. I'm not. I'm, I'm not even close to you. They are saying... Arrogant little wretch, did you think that the Romian colonists sullying our holy places would go unnoticed? Leave our worlds immediately or face the might of our fleets. But... But... <laughs> what? what? I, I don't understand. We're, we're not even... We're not even here. What, what happened? I don't understand. Desecrated a holy planet. Uh-oh. Don't tell me that. No, we didn't colonize that. Okay, so you just... You just... You just made an excuse? Is that it? Hmm. You really don't have a lot of... Uh, yeah, we're okay. We'll not be bullied. Ha! Ha! I don't know what got into you, but we didn't do it. And I'm innocent. You go over there. Battle is joined. Okay. Um, so we... System survey complete. Very good. We have surveyed rule. You can build an outpost. We have also surveyed Havonchir. So build an outpost over there. And then you're going here, and then you can survey that, and that, and you, when you've done that, can go over here. Okay. Very good. So we're still not at war with these guys, right? No, we're not. I honestly don't understand what we did to uh, infuriate these guys. I, I really have no idea. <laughs> hmm. Okay. So, we have gotten that. Now, you, both of you... Well, I guess one of you can go to Lasath, and the other one could go to Rimok. And then the Claude Armada is getting these, uh... Construction complete. Hey, hey, don't lag at me. You go there, there, and there to filth. So now we have all this under our Construction control. complete. What's that? Oh, all the uh, anomalies? Come on! Oh, we also have debris. Hmm. Yeah, but our ships, are, our science ships with leaders are uh, currently occupied, so... I'm sorry. We built the mining stations. You're still building surveys. Very good. Build the mining stations. You're also still building stuff. That's okay. Okay, so they do have some, uh, well, hardly any fleets. Are you mad at me for flying through your territory? No, no, you're not. Not yet, at least. Good. Mm, so we will be over here soon. System survey complete. And while we're at it, how about... We can add something here, but I don't want to. Uh, I do, however, want to see... Uh, no, no, no. You're almost done upgrading. Oh, construction on the Gateway and Fuldora system. Very good. We need that too. Hmm. Let's get two anchorages here as well. Who else was upgrading? Oh, you. You, anchorages, and you. Okay. Now you got that. Come here ASAP, please. Take the Colossus with you while you're at it. We're in combat in Rimok. Ooh, that's a very good station. Hmm, maybe I should have sent both fleets in at the same time. Oh well. I mean, it's it's not that my fleet can't beat it, but it will take unnecessary damage. 
Let's uh, bomb Snark heal. And we'll do that indiscriminately, because we're mean. Hee <laughs> Okay, now that we've started doing that... Oh, we already uh, have indiscriminate orbital bombardment. Very good. Um, <laughs> built the outpost. Upgrade. Scientific breakthrough Starbase. achieved. Ooh, devastated torpedoes. Very good. Um, let's get our armor hit points up, and then let's see. Oh yeah, we should look at the. Where are you? Gray scales, food output plus twenty percent. Gray crystals, kinetic weapon damage, energy System weapon damage, and explosive complete. damage plus ten percent. That's really good. Very cool. Okay, so how about you go and build that outpost there ASAP. And you, when you're done, I guess you're gonna go here first. Come on, hurry up. Because we really, uh... I don't want anybody to go get anything here. Anomaly found. Leave all the anomalies be for now. We'll, we'll deal with them later. Uh, is there a planet here? No, there is not. So you guys could continue on this way. Construction Come on, complete. Slowpoke. Let's go through Kerbal and then that way. How was this? Uh, 22k. Wow, that's impressive. And you are, I think, probably invadable. Mm, combat width is not that good, though. Okay, two, four, six. No, let's wait. Fine. And then the Claude Armada System survey will come complete. in and immediately go over here to secure that part. And I guess we might get Botine first and then go back. Maybe like that. Or should I go immediately over here? I don't think so because they their capital complete. Um, Spirons. So this should probably be their capital. Battle is joined. Yep. This is their capital system. So I want to get their capital as soon as possible. Yeah, let's do that. Um, battle is joined. Really? Huh. Oh, that's so adorable. I didn't even notice. But I enjoy killing you guys. I mean, uh... System survey complete. Yeah, why not? I have no problems with killing you. Ooh, Soaring Star Flock. Hang on. Claude Armada is over there. Where are you going? To Lasoth. Okay. I guess we uh, will hang out here and have uh, the benefit of the Starbase. And then... Now, that's a fight we'll want to see, right? Hang on, hang on, hang on. I know, I know. Hang on. Claude Armada versus the... What do you call it? Soaring Starflock. Ooh, I'm shooting things. Are those the, um... My, uh, my fighters? Wow, I'm getting- I'm taking some damage, that's for sure. But this was his major fleet, or their major fleet, I suppose. So when that's dead, which it is now, we'll probably be okay. Okay. I would like to take two fleets up to their home system. Very good. Invade, please. And then you, in the meantime, go here as well. And what are we doing here? Okay, we're still killing the Starbase. Let's increase the speed again. Initiating ground assault. Kill, 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 kill! Kill everything! Go over there, bomb that to oblivion if you can. That would be greatly appreciated. Uh, oh, that'll take Our a while. Our warriors are victorious! Enemy planet uh, Of course they are. And now that we have both 
over here. Um, no, 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 no. Let's, let's have them follow the Cloud Armada. Oh, now everybody's following each other. <laughs> it's a follow fest. Okay, let's go over there. Because you don't have a fleet here, so I'm okay out there. He has 115k fleet, and that's it. And a 9k fleet. Yeah. I'm not too impressed with that. Um, the new fleet, however, will be called... Conveniently, it's already starting with an H. The Hair Razors. Very good suggestion. There we go. Let's uh, reinforce you guys. Construction complete. Mm -mm -mm, we have a lot of debris to analyze. Uh, should I go look at the uh, L cluster? Just very briefly. Yeah. Oh, hang on. Somebody died. Somebody saw it fit to die on me. Build the outpost. Build that outpost before anything else. And um, after you've done that, you're going to build uh, that one. Okay. You research that anomaly. You research that anomaly and that anomaly. Oh, that's that's it for now. Who died? General Paki Jagor. Oh, really? Well, we need the general. Uh, army disengagement chance and collateral damage. Army damage and collateral damage. Butcher. Restrained. Collateral damage is higher. I don't want collateral damage to be high. I want it to be lower. So let's get restrained. Yeah. Let's get Fak Bokorov. Okay. Let's look at what we're doing here. Um, so we have two fleets over here equaling 110k. We should be okay going in here, right? Yes, we are. Go. Move it. I like to move it, move it. Hmm. Let's see, 710, 9, okay. Colossus is coming Scientific in as well. Scientific breakthrough <laughs> achieved. We have higher shield hit points, very good. Uh, let's get energy weapon damage up. Okay, we've taken this system. Uh, so, who's following whom? Follow them, and both of you bomb this planet, please. Junk ball. The ISS and Magra crew report that what first appeared to our scanners as an asteroid is in fact a gigantic floating ball of junk. Comprised of the broken remains of various vehicles, rockets, and hazardous materials, many of them radioactive, if I may add, the junk ball seems to be the detritus, detritus of an unknown alienation in the early space age. It would appear this nation was an interstellar litterer, ejecting dangerous industrial waste into orbit rather than disposing of it planet side. Sounds like a cat, you know, doing their thing in their litter box and just spewing all of the litter around. Radiometric dating suggests these remains are millions of years old and have been floating through space from an unknown point of origin for most of that time. Science officer Sok Batorak notes that some of the materials found on this floating junk heap are quite rare and could be refined into useful resources. Waste not, want not. So we have one of two options happening, 50% chance of Garanthium ore or 50% chance of Aurelium ore. Very cool. I guess we will see what happened soon. Um, they're gonna go around and go like that. Pretty sure they will. So I really need to finish this quickly. It'll take a while yet. Um, because that's usually what the AI does, they're mean. Okay, you're doing well. And now we just need Avim and Russell Haig, and then all of this is right for They are assaulting powers. our space See? Course. Wait, what? I knew it! Uh oh, no, 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 no. No, don't kill my kitten. Go. Save it. Construction complete. Please don't. <gasps> the fleet has made the ultimate sacrifice. Oh, no. Whoa, they killed my kitten. How did they get there so fast? Did they do a jump? They must have done a jump. They killed my colossal kitten. 
I'm gonna have to build a new one. I'm gonna go into the shroud and stay there. The corpse of a dead Rubian tumbles through the void head. Well, that's very appropriate, isn't it? The putrid carcass emits a shrill screech before it vanishes out of sight. Let's increase our ship speed. We, we need that. Oh, I'm gonna kill you and I'm gonna smother you and I'm gonna. Oh. They must have done a jump. I'm seriously, seriously gonna leave nothing alive of you. You know, I wish you were never born. Killing my kitten. Who dares doing that? Not okay. Terraforming Canada discovered. Our detailed survey of Terupia 7C has revealed that it may once have supported life in the distant past. There are significant deposits of frozen water at the polar ice caps and beneath the moon's surface. The existence of valley networks suggests that the water may once have flowed freely. The energy cost would be daunting, but we do have the technology to gradually terraform this moon into something that would support life once again. Okay. Man, I'm so mad. I'm so, so mad. You guys, you're gonna, you're gonna die. I'm telling you right now. Construction you're complete. To die. You are so dead. Oh, there's another 12k fleet. Ah! So annoying. Kill my kid. Not okay with that. I'll need to wait until I have enough minerals to uh, and get me kitten back. Well, I guess I'm just gonna go through to Samnivik. Oh, I can't. But I can uh, do this. Hey, and their fleet even left. They jumped away. They got away. That's not okay. Kill him. We're gonna kill you. We're gonna leave nothing whole. You will be wiped from existence. And they jumped away again. Did you see that? Let's keep bombing for our deer. Oh, that's gonna take forever. That's why I wanted the kitten. Okay, they're going again. On the shoulders of giants, it appears that the asteroid VX, no, V4XNQW1 and the surrounding debris originate from a former planet. Deep within the center of the asteroid, we can find traces of extremely valuable minerals. There are also hints of bacterial life that celestial body once bore the promise of life. Uh, that has now died in the vacuum of space. This shows us that the celestial body once bore the promise of life. Wow. Reading hard. Um. Hmm. Go. Yeah. You guys, you're so dumb. Seriously. So we're gonna keep one fleet over here attacking that planet. And then the other one is just gonna kill them. Um. I mean, this is just a very, very temporary, small, tiny setback. We will definitely get these people uh, dead soon. Actually, I'm going to land this army right now. And get the tail swishers back here as soon as we can. Initiating ground assault. So uh, I think in the ours. next episode, we're going to bring the Spiring Collective to their knees. That's the, uh, that's the goal. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. And if you did, hit the like button and please consider subscribing. It helps out immensely. New episodes in Ruby and Hierarchy come out every Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday at 8 p.m. CET. And I will see you in the next one.